Hey there, gaming enthusiasts. Welcome back to Product Critique. Today, we're diving into the world of mobile gaming with the Backbone 1 PlayStation Edition mobile controller. Is it a good fit for PS5 owners, or does it shine better with Xbox Game Pass and Xbox Cloud Gaming? Let's find out. The Backbone 1 PlayStation Edition boasts an officially licensed, serviceable design, available for both iOS and Android users. With its sleek matte white finish, it matches the aesthetic of the PS5 and DualSense wireless controller, offering a comfortable grip during gameplay. The triggers, analog sticks, and face buttons feel high quality, but the D-pad could use some improvement as it feels slightly loose. One downside of the Backbone 1 is its awkward button placement. The ancillary buttons, like menu, screenshot, and sharing buttons, are positioned quite far down the sides of the controller. This makes accessing them a bit inconvenient, especially on the left side, as you need to move your thumb away from the analog stick. Now, here's where things get interesting. While the controller bears the PlayStation button layout, the touchpad solution can be a bit of a letdown for PS5 owners. During remote play, you'll need to double tap your phone's screen to activate touchpad input, and this quickly becomes irksome. As a result, the Backbone 1 feels like a better fit for Xbox Series 10s players, especially those using Xbox Game Pass streaming, where the touchpad is not as crucial. On the performance front, the Backbone 1 does impress with its low input lag during both cloud streaming and remote play. Of course, your overall experience will depend on the strength of your internet connection, as remote play requires Wi-Fi. Nonetheless, the controller's Backbone app makes navigating through Xbox Game Pass, PS Remote Play, and controller-supported Apple Store or Google Play titles a breeze. So, is the Backbone 1 PlayStation Edition worth considering? Absolutely! It's a serviceable mobile controller with a sleek design, solid build quality, and low input lag during gameplay. If you're an Xbox Series 10s player diving into Xbox Game Pass or Xbox Cloud Gaming, this controller will be right up your alley. However, PS5 owners might find the touchpad solution a bit awkward during remote play. Nonetheless, it's still a great choice for mobile gaming on a budget. And there you have it, our review of the Backbone 1 PlayStation Edition mobile controller. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to Product Critique for more gaming and tech reviews. Let us know in the comments below if you've tried the Backbone 1 and your thoughts on its performance. Until next time, happy gaming!